Hey guys, it's Jessica, and today I'm gonna bring you my top 15 gift sets, value kits, those kinds of little sets that you can buy. Most of these, honestly, I think you can find year round, but a lot of them are here and around for the holidays. Um, so I will link every set that I mentioned below. I think five of these are from Ulta and 10 of them are from Sephora. They range in price. Some of them are under $10, some of them are over $40. So there, I'm gonna do my five from Ulta first because I really, they have a lot of different stuff, but these were really the only the, the only five that really stood out to me out of all of their pages and pages of value kits and gift sets. And then I've got 10 from Sephora. So if you enjoy this kind of video, I hope you'll subscribe before you leave, hit that notification bell so you're notified when I upload new videos right away. And let's go ahead and get into it. So the first one I wanna mention is from Clinique. This is their Party Pop set and it is $12. So it comes with two of their mini little lip, what do they actually call them? Lip color and primer. I have tried one of these in store and it's been in my cart and like the shade I wanted was sold out for a while. So I'm dying to try this line because when I tried it in store and I, the only reason I, my attention was brought to it is because the person working at Ulta was wearing it. And I was like, what are you wearing on your lips? She's like, let me show you. And I was like, oh my gosh, because it's a primer and lip color in one, but it just looked so like plump and it was still like matte, but it looked so good on her lips. I was like reeling. I was like, I need this lip color. So I think I'm, I personally am going to buy this one. It's in my like hearts or my favorites on Ulta's website because I think for $12, $6 each, you know, they are smaller, but the formula is what really was like, oh my gosh, I've not ever tried a lip color like this. So I think that's a really good deal, even though they're miniature and the colors that come with it are uh, cherry pop and plum pop. So it looks like there's a nice bright red and then there's kind of a more pinkish purplish light colored one too. So I'm totally, totally, I would totally recommend that set. The next one is the Soap and Glory Happy Pamper gift set. This is only $7. It comes with their Righteous Butter, like body butter, and it comes with their Clean On Me body wash. I've tried both. I really like both. I think they smell good. The body butter is super moisturizing. The body wash, you know, is a body wash, but I like the smell of it. Um, I think they are more small like travel size, but for seven bucks, if you've never tried these, it's a great time to try them. But if you know you already like them or you travel a lot and you'd need this size as well, that'd be another good reason to buy it. Again, this is something I'm thinking about buying for myself just because I do travel a lot and this is these are two products that I genuinely really like. Seven bucks, I mean, that's like 350 each. I don't think that's too, too crazy. The next one's from Too Faced and I'm gonna recommend this one with a kind of caveat. So it's their under, un, I knew I wouldn't be able to say it, under the kissle toe. I wanted to say under the kisser toe. <laughs> that sounds very bizarre. Under the kissle toe, uh, little set. And so it's got four small size, like deluxe size of a bunch of their lip products. So it's two, it has one of their melted lip colors. It has their melted chocolate. It has a melted latex and a melted matte. The reason I say I'm gonna recommend this with a caveat is that I do think that the melted mattes are kind of drying. I mean, if you don't mind that, I mean, there are people that love it. So it's not, my opinion is not the be all end all. We all have different likes when it comes to, especially like lip products, what you like on your lips. So the melted matte is truly matte. It dries down, it gets really dry in the center. Of course I'm saying that and I'm sure like my lip color right now looks crazy. Um, but I do like their melted lip colors. I think they're comfortable. They don't totally dry down, but they're kind of more of a whipped feel to them. And I do really like that. And I've not tried their melted latex. So I do think it's a good set. If you look at the colors that, it, you know, the range, it's got that pink and kind of that brown, that peach, and then that like really vampy color, which I think is fun that it kind of varied. So I think that 25 bucks for that is a really good deal. Um, whether you've tried them or not, I think it's a good deal. The next one is the Ulta Try Me, the season's most coveted makeup sampler. And it is $29. I was kind of impressed with all that this came with. So it comes with the Bare Minerals lipstick, which their lipsticks are usually very, very comfortable. I've tried, I think, all of their ranges. All of them have been very comfortable to wear. Um, and then it comes with like a Lancome Lash Primer. I've not tried this particular one, but if you like the kind of white fibery kind of thing, I think you'd like it. Um, it comes with one of the Becca highlighters, which are amazing. And the reality is this is a smaller size. You're not ever gonna use up. If you are watching makeup videos, you probably have more than one highlighter. It takes a long time to use one up. So even though this is the deluxe size, I think it's still, I mean, that's, amazing. Um, so, and that is in the shade Opal, by the way, which I think is absolutely stunning. If you've not seen it, let me just show you. 
I have the full size, but it shattered everywhere and I repressed it, which I did successfully repress it with um, alcohol. There's tons of videos on YouTube if you look it up, if you have no idea what I'm talking about. This is such a pretty highlighter. I do think it lost a little of its luster when I repressed it. it. I might just be in my head, but I feel like it was a lot more lustrous than this, but it is a gorgeous, gorgeous highlighter. Totally worth the hype behind it. Anyway, um, so you also get a buxom full-on lip polish in Dolly. It has this tingle to it. I love, I might have, I think that one's in my purse. I have that exact shade. I love the buxom lip polish. They're tingly. If you don't like that, you won't like it. They kind of plump your lips a little bit, or at least it feels like it does. Um, and it's just a nice neutral color that just looks nice on its own, and I highly recommend that. Also comes with the It Cosmetics Brow Power Universal Brow Pencil, which you can use for any brow. Um, you, the harder you press, the darker it is. I've had that. I like it. Um, I'm not crazy picky with brows, um, but that was one I didn't love love, not because the, I just felt like I couldn't get the right color, but it's not a bad brow product. Uh, it also comes with the Lancome Sills Booster Mascara. It comes with the Lorac Mini Tantalizer Bronzer. And what else? Tarte Man Eater Mascara. Oh, I didn't know this came with this. What did I miss here? Oh, my favorite, the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Liner is my favorite. Uh, well, it's one of my favorite liquid liners. But it also says a $5 gift card towards any full-size item featured in this box. That is smart. That is really cool. So, 29 bucks. it's kind of like you're getting it for 24 since you're getting the gift card toward a full size of one of those. That's awesome. That is absolutely awesome. So I totally recommend that. All right, so the next one is the Tarte Goddess Essentials Color Collection. This is amazing, and I had to look it up to make sure I wasn't crazy. This is two of their full-size products for $30 and a deluxe size mascara. Now, the mascara is okay. It's their light, Lights, Cameras, Lashes. Some people love it. Some people don't. But I'm really recommending it, even if that weren't even in it, because that means you're getting the full-size Tarte Blush and Exposed, which is like their best-selling. I love that shade. It's such a natural pink for $15, and then you're getting their full-size Park Avenue Princess Bronzer for $15. That's amazing, because both of those separately are like $26, $30. So that's a stellar deal. They say it's a $68 value. I fully believe that. Now I'm thinking about getting this because I no longer have the Tarte Blush, nor do I have the bronzer. So I'm like, maybe it's already in my like favorites there too. That's an awesome deal. That is a fantastic deal. So those are all my Ulta ones. Let's go to my Sephora ones. Um, the first one, this one I'm kind of counting as one together. I have recently fallen in love with Kiehl's and I hate that because their products can be really expensive, but I've quickly learned that the only way to buy Kiehl's products is in like these little gift sets. So the first one I saw that caught my eye is their Dry Relief Duo. It's $16. Um, they say it's an $18 value, and I, that's why I almost didn't recommend it, because their lip balm is the bomb. I have discovered so many good lip balms lately. But this is another one. This is what I keep in my nightstand, and I put on every single night. It's such a good lip balm. Apparently, they've used the same formula since, like, forever. I don't know. It said it on the little bottle, but of course it doesn't say it here. But it also comes with like a travel size of their creme decor body lotion, which is amazing. It's been relieving my dry skin on my legs, which is not just dry skin, but like itchy dry skin. It's so amazing. So luxurious. I have the full size and it's expensive. So now I'm like, well, now I'm going to want it when I travel. So this is something I'm thinking about buying. But the other one that's kind of in tandem with this is their Disney and Kiehl's hydration essentials. It's $29 and you get the same creme de corps thing. You get the same lip balm, but you also get their ultra facial cleanser. You get their ultimate strength hand salve, which I've heard amazing things and their ultra facial cream, which I have used only in trial size. And it's really, really moisturizing. So the only thing Disney about it. And I was like, really is the box. And so I was like, it's a really cool box, but I'm like, I don't need a box, you know? But for 29 bucks, it says $36 value. In my opinion, it's gotta be more than that because that's like the full size uh, lip balm, as far as I can tell. And then everything, I mean, anyway, so I think that's an awesome value. I totally recommend. Okay, I gotta keep going because this video is gonna be forever long. We have this uh, gold, Beauty Blender Gold Mine, and it is limited edition. And I think if you've got the money, I would recommend this one more because it comes with two full-size beauty blenders for 40 bucks, which that is what it would cost. But you also get the full-size solid cleanser and you get the Blotterazzi. Now, I've not tried the Blotterazzi, but I figure, you know what, even if it didn't have that, 
you're getting two beauty blenders for the regular price $40. You're basically getting a free cleanser and you're getting the Blotterazzi for free. So if you know you're going to buy beauty blenders anyway or you want to have more than one, this has the pink and the nude, which I do have the nude one now and I do like it because it doesn't show the foundation as much. So if it's dirty, you can't tell. That could be a blessing and a curse. But um, So I do think that's a really good deal. Next one is this Ula Henriksen. Ole Hendricks, I, every, I never say it right. Anyway, it's their Three Little Wonders mini set. It's $25, $39 value. The reason I recommend this is because it has that truth serum. This is something that I have tried recently in tiny form, and this has, I think it's still a smaller form, but it's not their teeny tiny, maybe it is. But if you've been wanting to try that, it also has their Invigorating Night Transformation Gel and their Sheer Transformation perfecting moisturizer. All of these are highly rated. All of these are like highly recommended by people that know a lot about skincare, which is not me. I'm learning. This is something I'm pretty sure I'm going to buy this holiday season for myself because I really want to try all of those. And I remember trying the Truth Serum a long, long time ago. And I remember liking it, but once I ran out, I was like, well, I'm not going to, it's too expensive. I'm not going to buy it again. But I'm like, okay, for $25, I could try all three of them, get a feel for if I do want to buy the full size. So I think that's an awesome deal. Okay, this is something I'm wearing. This is the ColourPop Feelin' Fine Lip Gloss Trio. 18 bucks, so you're getting each for $6. Now, the reality is the ColourPop lip glosses aren't that expensive to begin with. But really, I just like all of these colors. So the one I'm wearing on my lips today is called Fairy Me, and that's one of the three. These are high shine glitter lip glosses, but I think they're comfortable. I love the packaging, which I know sounds dumb, but at the holidays, you kind of just want like glitzy, glamoury packaging. This is what I'm wearing. Now, I do have it on top of like a bold red. I can show you. Um, I put it on top of the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Pioneer, which I can also link below. I love this stuff. I love that whole line. But uh, it just added this really nice shimmer and made it look more berry-like. And I just like it. I think they're really comfortable. The whole set is really pretty. Um, and that's why I would recommend it. I think it'd be a really beautiful gift that for $18 looks more expensive than it really is, but um, I really like them. And especially as we're moving away from more matte colors, I think that's an awesome way to add three really shiny, beautiful lip glosses to your collection. Next one, this is a personal favorite. The, this is the Cinema Secrets Makeup Brush Cleaner Pro Starter Kit. So you get an eight ounce of the brush cleanser, best brush cleanser I've ever used. It works in seconds. It dries so fast. It is like the strongest brush cleanser. There's a reason like makeup artists use it because it's so quick. Um, but it also comes with the tin, which I do use because what I do is I pour the brush cleanser in it and then my brushes, I just dip in there really quickly, clean them, put to the side to dry. And it makes brush cleaning so fast. So the tin, you buy it once and you have forever. I mean, you can clean it out. It's not going anywhere. The brush cleanser, I have like the giant one of because I fell in love with it, but it's sold out all the time. Uh, so I think this is 24 bucks for this. It says $30 value. I think it's worth it because you get the tin with it and I might buy it. Well, but see, I don't need the tin, but the other one's always sold out. <laughs> anyway, totally recommend. This next one's an expensive one. And I did buy this myself during the VIB sale. It's the Clarisonic Flawless Finish Essentials. Now, I only recommend this if you already have a Clarisonic. If you don't, look at the other Clarisonic kits they have. Um, I know because you need the actual thing to be able to hold these. But if you are a Clarisonic junkie and you know you're going to end up buying refills anyway, like for the heads, then buy this because you are going to save money. Now, if you are not, this won't make sense for you because if you don't know that you're going to buy a bunch of refills for it, then don't spend the money. Why I like this is because it also has the foundation brush head. The foundation brush fits on any Clarisonic model. I've double checked that on, I have three of them. <laughs> I'm like embarrassed to say that. It kind of just happened. I think I bought one and then one was sent to me and one was recently. And I'm very, very thankful for that because I do use them in my bathroom. I use them now with the foundation. Um, here I can show it to you. Um, so this is the foundation brush head. So it comes with this and it comes with three uh, of the regular cleansing refills. So for 85 bucks, it's a, it's a $116 value. Stellar if you know you're going to use them. If you don't, it might not be worth the money. But I wanted to mention it. The other one that I personally bought is the Sunday Riley Flash Fix Kit. I was tired of hearing about, oh, Sunday Riley is so good. But it's so expensive. And I'm like, 
I want to try the Good Genes Lactic Acid Treatment so bad, but it's so expensive. So this was the cheapest way I found that I could try it. So it's $28. You get the Good Genes, a really small size, which is an AHA exfoliator. It's been doing some wonderful things for my skin. I had had so many hormonal breakouts, and I feel like it helped with that. It helped like, kind of revive my skin, get rid of some of the redness, just kind of increase that turnover, and I'm really liking it, which scares me because that means... I might want to buy a more expensive, you know, like the big size of it, and I... Anyway, it also comes with the Ceramic Slip Clay Cleanser, which I've been using the past week. I really like that too. It does feel actually really nice when you use it. Now, would I buy the full size of that? I don't know. It's not nearly as expensive as the Good Jeans, I will say that. But I think for 28 bucks, that's a great kit to try those out, and I never want to run out. All right, the last one is this Sephora Favorites Give Me More Lip Set. So... It's $68, which I know is like, oh my gosh, but it's $254 value. So if you're shopping for someone that loves lip products or you yourself love lip products, um, it has five full size and then 10 deluxe size. So that is a big selling point for it. And I know a lot of people are like, I'm not paying $68 for a ton of tiny lip products, but at least it does have five full size, which I think is really cool. So I hope this was fun to watch, whether it helped you think about products. Okay, hair, I see that you're there. Figure out where you wanna go. Um, hopefully this helped you figure out some products that you're either wanting to buy for yourself or someone else, maybe a beauty lover in your life. Um, I just think these are all so great. I mean, they're great stocking stuffers, they're great gifts, they're great um, you know, ways to stock up on things maybe you already love or maybe you need travel sizes of things. Whatever the reasoning might be, I love watching these kinds of videos. I don't know why. A lot of times I watch them and I don't buy anything. I just like watching them. I'm just weird like that. But if you did enjoy, I hope you'll subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like this format and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!